Hey everyone, it's Gamerock121. Welcome to Cloud Climber. This is created by uh, Two Star Games, I'm assuming is his name. I'll double check. But it's a free game on Steam. It's about basically, basically we're exploring these towers with the end of humanity. He also created another game over here called My Beautiful Paper Smile. Maybe I'll get that. It looks like the horror game. It actually looks interesting. If you guys want me to try that, tell me. Um, but I'm gonna play this and we're gonna check and see how it goes. I don't know how long it is either. Ooh. Graphics look nice. Another day has arrived. <laughs> Another day. I had best get my water before going to work. Water? How do I? That's inventory. Mouse? Yeah, okay. Uh, stand diary page 1489. Jesus Christ. I may need to get to the neighboring tower in the future, but I know the other buildings keep the entrance to the bridge locked. I saw a key on the table at the top of our tower a few weeks ago before I we went to get more building supplies. I haven't been up there in a few days, so I don't need to check if it unlocks the bridge door. The other tower has ever become vacant. I might need to get across, so I'll have to keep this in mind. Left mouse button, exit. And then grab the key and then hold the inventory. So I got a chest key now. Okay, um. Oh. 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 Um. Can I? I guess I can't mess with it. That's cool. Construction on the last tower stopped weeks ago. Wow. I can only assume that the builders have met their fate by now. I believe it's safe enough for me to go and continue building higher yet from where they left off. That looks cool. I'll need cool. to travel across the other two towers to get there, but I'm sure I can find a way. Other two towers. Oh my gosh, that looks awesome. You can't even see anything down there. That must be pollution. See, the only thing that pops in my is pollution. What's this? Bernie the Great and Terrible. <laughs> Diary page 69. Nice. For months, we've been building faster than ever, yet it seems as if every time we play a new level, the clouds raise higher and higher. I could have sworn we were close to them decades ago, but we're still not done yet. I can only hope that we're getting close. Signed, Bernie the Great and Terrible. Jeez, that wind. I wonder what happens if I go down. Can I sprint? No. Because this, because this one's my my room. Okay, that's locked. Uh, let's, oh, it's it's broken. I can't go down anyway. Okay. Okay. He 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 said he said that decades ago they were close to the clouds. If we're still close to the clouds, that's pollution. Like hundred percent pollution. And can I get in there? Ooh, I can't. Anything in here? Ooh, no, that's not right though. Joey Diary, page 400, 420. Yes. I've been building all day long, and Bernie the Great and Terrible has been sitting on his butt acting as foreman. AKA, he doesn't do any work and drinks all our water. I've started locking my water, my water chest just in case he really does think he's above us all. Okay, so Bernie the Great and Terrible is being an asshole, basically. That's nice. Nothing. Uh, let's check the other door. There's always two doors? Oh, this must be the bridge. Yeah, that's the bridge. That's... It's so loud. Can I get up here? No? Okay. Oh, I got the key. Okay, so I can't jump off. Okay. I had a feeling that was going to be the case. Bridge door key was used. Um... <laughs> I like it. Edna Diary, page 36. I can't believe today is the 100th anniversary of our tower. I know others have been building much longer, but, but and now I wish our grandparents had taken this whole thing more seriously. 100 years ago, they decided things were getting dangerous, but why didn't they see the problem 200 years ago or even longer? I'm so glad they started building, but I just wish we had seen this coming. Wait, that's say coming earlier or coming? Yeah, I've seen this coming. It's been quite some time since I was on the second tower. I haven't crossed this bridge since the builders became greedy and took the supplies that were meant to come to our tower. Just like all the other towers, its inhabitants quickly grew desperate and aggressive. Now it stands empty. 
Uh, Kyle Diary, page 45. I guess I knew this day would come, but I didn't expect it to come this soon. Yesterday, we started extreme rationing of our water. A few days back, we saw getting supplies from the ground crew on our list. We can only assume that they stole the supply for themselves, ran out of water and food sources, or simply died. If we don't get into, cloud, into the cloud soon, we might need to see if we can get some more some from one of our from one of the neighboring towers. Oh, jeez, I can't talk. And nah, broken, can't go down. All right, time to go up. All right, anything I can get in here? I can. Nothing, nothing. I don't got a chest key. Yeah, there is. Bertha Diary page 9,825. What? <laughs> How do you write a diary nine over nine, almost 10,000 times? Holy crap. Wouldn't it be ironic if it rained now after decades of building? Now would be the perfect time since we started rationing our supplies more, but I have a good feeling about this. I've, I know I've never seen rain myself, but grandmother always told me how wonderful it felt. It would be so surreal to be on the ground and see water for miles instead of desert and wasteland. I'm sure it will rain someday. We just need to survive until then. Well, um, it's pretty obvious you didn't. They installed a rope cart on this level to get to the third tower. I should be able to use it to get across. Mm-hmm. Are you gonna talk anymore? No. Okay. Uh, Kyle Diary, page 46. I tried to be reasonable. I tried to talk with them, but those greedy little scumbags on Tower 1. Tower 1. Didn't want to share their supplies with us. I'm not going to die miles above the ground, dying up, drying up like a racing while other people watch. I'm going over there tonight to take everything I need so I can last long enough to watch everyone else die. So this, so okay, so this guy became greedy. And desperate for survival, which is under which understandable during that time, but still, you you're kind of screwing over others. You do it. Oh, this is a staircase over here. I was walking right by it. Okay. How exactly do I? What am I supposed to do? Was I not supposed to come up here? Okay, so that's a rope bridge. All right, uh, what, what am I supposed to do? Oh, uh, I guess this? Yeah. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh. Oh, I get it. I could okay. almost call this place beautiful if these dust storms weren't so suffocating. Dust storms? Oh, look at that. I can see other towers in the distance. That's weird. Can I crouch? No? Okay. I don't think there's any creatures in this, but this, this I is... I hope I find what I'm looking for at the fourth tower. But this is actually quite beautiful. Like, yes, into humanity and all that, but damn, this looks good. Like, just look at that. Sure, sure, some of these look kind of cartoony, but I don't care. Uh, heading diary page one. Oh, I couldn't be more frustrated right now. We're running out of water, running out of building supplies, and Carl just won't get along with me. At least five times a day, he pretends he does, he's going to push me off the tower. I swear, if I do fall someday, it'll be his fault. Okay. Joey diary page 556. Yesterday, had it. <laughs> had anything fell off the tower. I don't know how it happened, but it was a shame, especially since he had the key to most of our water chests. We'll need to break the lock ones open soon since we've almost emptied out the other ones. There is something down there. I don't like it. Like, I can hear it. Okay, so I can't go through here. It's like type thing, and I, and I don't like it whatsoever. All right, open. Uh, okay, let's see. Carl Diary, page fifty-seven. I just can't get over. Headang gave the most, gave the ab absolute best reactions when I messed with him. For the past week, I've been pretending to get mad and shove my arms at him as if to push him off there. I didn't think this will ever get old, and I can tell Headang loves it. No, he fucking hates it, dumbass. Because doing something like that can actually f have someone trip over and fall. No, that's... Looks like I'll need to fix this bridge. Yep. Can I 
open this chest now. Oh! I got a water, wooden planks. And uh, did I go down here? Oh! That's pretty cool, actually. It's hard to believe that I'm the last one here. You're the last one? What? Are we an android? I never thought it would end like this. Where the hell is everyone else? Makes right. you wonder what the whole point was in the first place. There's no way you're the last one. Uh, no ambition. Out of everyone on this earth, our families are the one, only ones who took the water crisis seriously. We were the ones who started building. We, we were mocked and told we were insane. We were the ones who everyone looked to when the lakes and rivers dried up. Our blueprints were the ones that were stolen as people became desperate. Out of everyone on this earth, we are the ones who deserve to survive. The clouds are brimming with liquid life, but are still so evasive. We've been building for a long time, but we're not done yet. We have farther to go. We will climb the clouds. The sun of Zeclair. What? Dewey Diary, page 400, 490. Uh, this evening, Kevin made a really cheesy speech about how we will, we alone will prevail and how we're the only descendants of the great ones who deserve life. It was constantly, it was honestly the cringiest speech I've ever heard and that's really saying a lot considering the other stuff he's been saying lately. He also keeps referring to, to himself in the third person and only responds to us if we call him Z son of Zilclair. Zil Zilchar, I think it actually, not Zilclair, Zilchar. Son of Zilchar. Okay, yeah, this must be the final tower. Uh, yeah, let me go ahead and go up. Because obviously I can't reach these other ones right here. Wait, how does he eat though? If they've literally been surviving off of water this entire time. Oh, stack of planks. How the hell, how the hell have they been eating? This place really is beautiful, even with the dust storms. See, even he agrees. This actually looks great. I've been working on that tower my whole life, and never once stopped to appreciate what we spent our lives building. We only looked up to the clouds, hoping we'd someday reach them so we could prolong our lives. But now that everyone's gone, I know any attempt I might make at accomplishing that would be futile. Rather than spending the rest of my life building a tower, maybe it's time I took a break. It's been a long time, but I think I'm finally done. Oh, I thought he was about to jump off. Oh, that was gonna mess with my stomach greatly. It rained! <laughs> really? That's it? Oh, wow, that wasn't a long video, but damn, that was really good. I liked it. I wanna try his other game, but I wanna know if you guys want wanna see that. Um Wow, there really isn't there really isn't a lot left. All right, um, I I hope you guys enjoyed that. I certainly did. I thought it was very nice. If you guys want to see his other game, just let me know. Put it in the comments or something. Uh, remember, it's called what was it called? Uh, my beautiful paper smile. Tell, 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 tell me if you guys want to see it. It is created by Two Star Games. The Cloud Climber one is completely free on Steam. And it's definitely something that I think you guys should probably play if you want to. Uh, but thank, but thanks, thanks for watching this. Have fun, play games, and think of a new strategy quickly.